And now here I explain the equilibrium of uh, how the consumer attains the equilibrium in case of a two commodity case. Now I'm taking uh, biscuits on the x-axis and uh, I'll be taking mm, this uh, chocolates on the y-axis. So firstly I will draw up the uh, budget line. And that shows the various combinations of the goods that a consumer uh, can buy with a given level of the income. Now I will draw a set of indifferent curves. Let's say for example this is indifference curve 1. Now this is indifference curve 2. This is indifference curve 3. Let me draw one more. Oh, let me change the color first. Now this is indifference curve 4. Now let me drop some points on this. Now now this one two three now this is a b c d and e let me name this as f g and h now uh, as we have noted uh, all the points on the budget line actually uh, mean that uh, whichever is achievable uh, we, uh, all that all the income of the consumer is getting consumed on this budget line so definitely a consumer would like to be on this budget line so points a comma b comma c d and e are possible to mm, buy with the current level of the income now the points uh, at point number f this point is not possible uh, to buy because it is outside the budget line for the reasons that have been explained and the h and g are inside the budget line so the consumer is not spending full income in this point so they are also not to be considered because they will not give the full satisfaction now i have to consider between the points a b c d e so i have to consider between these points a b c d and e now uh, let me know drop the uh, points on the indifference curve one so we have the a and we have e on the indifference curve one and now on indifference curve two we have b and d on indifference curve three we have point c now we know that higher indifference curve that represents higher satisfaction and all these points are achievable by a consumer so then why not to uh, choose the, the, the point on the highest indifference curve that gives the highest satisfaction so it is this point that is the point number C this point C that gives the highest consumption to an individual and on this point if you see the budget line and the indifference curve are but uh, the budget line is tangent to indifference curve so at, at equilibrium the budget line is tangent to the i indifference curve so on this point what happens uh, it is the uh, indifference curve that is that becomes tangent to the budget line so if i uh, draw a point so this is the amount of uh, of the chocolates and the amount of the biscuit that a consumer should buy in order to attain the equilibrium in order to attain the max satisfaction so uh, wherever the point of indifference curve and the budget line becomes tangent it is known as the equilibrium point